Hey guys, it's Olivia here. So I'm not sure if you're the same as me, but in the morning or at night once I've had a shower, I can't really be bothered standing there for 20 minutes, half an hour, blow drying my hair and damaging it and then it gets all frizzy and it's just, it's too much work. So in this video, I have two of my go-to wet hair hairstyles for you. So if you're interested in learning how to do them, then just keep on watching. So the first hairstyle is the two strand plait. So I've got my hair up in a towel turban, I'm just taking it out and drying the ends of my hair. Then I'm taking the Tresemme Split Remedy Leave-In Conditioning Spray and I'm just spraying that in the ends of my hair and running that through with my fingers. Next I'm going to part my hair into two. do this however you want and taking a hair tie I'm going to tie up the side that we aren't going to use so I'm tying up one side and we're going to plait the other side just so it's not in our way so starting off we are going to take a small piece of hair close to your parting and we are going to split that into two strands Now taking the front strand that is closest to your face, we're going to pull it over top of the second strand. Then what you want to do is you want to add a little piece of hair to that front strand and pull the front strand over top of the second strand. So adding a little piece of hair to the front strand and then pulling it over top. Adding a little piece of hair to the front strand and pulling it over. Adding a little piece of hair to the front strand and pulling it over top. So you want to keep doing that all the way down your hair until all your hair on that side is incorporated. So once you get to the bottom and you've incorporated all the hair on that side, you want to take your two strands and split it into three. Now this may sound very complicated, but if you just watch, you take your two strands and you split it into three. And then what you want to do is you want to plait normally. So taking the strand on the outside, putting it in the middle, strand from the outside, putting it in the middle, strand from the outside, putting it in the middle. And you want to plait all the way down your hair until you get to the bottom. Now plaiting this with the three strand plait will help um, the two strand plait at the top so it won't unravel or unfold and it will stay in longer. So now that that side's done, move on to the Splitting that into two, taking the front strand, pulling it over top, adding some hair to the front strand, pulling it over top, adding some hair to the front strand, pulling it over top, adding some hair to the front strand, pulling it over top. The exact same as we did on the other side, incorporating all your hair. So once you have done that and all your hair is incorporated into the plait, you want to take those two strands and split it into three and then plait normally. Taking the outside strand, putting it in the middle, outside strand, putting it in the middle and then securing it with a hair tie. And those are the two plaits done. So now if you want to change this hairstyle up, taking one of your strands pull it into the middle and turn it inwards so that we don't have any bumps or any pieces coming out and you do that with the other strand turn it inwards and then tie those two strands together with a hair tie you can wear this as a ponytail you could make the two plaits into one or into a fishtail plait
or you could even go a step further and put it into a bun by just twisting it around itself and securing that with bobby pins and a hair tie. The next hairstyle we have is the messy messy bun. So taking your wet hair, I'm just going to brush the bottoms of it. I'm going to collect all my hair into a ponytail, turn my head upside down, and then just using my fingers brush all the hair into a ponytail. Now if you have thick hair, you can secure this ponytail with a hair tie. I don't need to. And then all I do is just wrap it around itself. And then I'm going to secure it with a hair tie. Simple as that. Now if you've got any pieces that are left out, you can use bobby pins to pin them up. And those are the hairstyles done. Hope you guys enjoyed. So I cut myself off there, but I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you want to see any more, then just comment down below. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe, and I will see you